this is Big Pot 100 and today I'm here to show you guys this white blue. Isn't it pretty? And my eyes actually. I had a moment up there. So, um, to watch a whole tutorial you gotta guys stick around and don't forget to subscribe my channel and comment below and let me know and like my videos and share it. Thumbs up. I like that thumbs up button. Share it if you if you love ramen noodles. For the sake of the ramen noodles, okay. <laughs> and I know I cut my hair short. It's actually today I get a cut and my sister did it. It's, and I'm super loving that because all of my dead ends are out. And I'm just nice and to my natural black color again. And I have some like this part, but I guess I'm... I like this lighter part in here on my bangs. I actually tried to highlight it, go to pink, and then I didn't like it and it went back to black. So, now it's fading. We're getting there, okay? We're getting there. So, I hope you guys like my troll and stick around and watch the whole videos. It's not gonna be boring. I'm pretty fun to watch it, okay? And I shall see you guys soon. Love you. Bye. Guys, so, uh, you already know what foundation I use. I use uh, Lancome 24 hour wear foundation. It's too bright. There you go. There we go. Focus. Okay, so I use that uh, for my foundation. I already applied my foundation. Sorry, my hair's are so short now. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna apply my favorite concealer on and um, highlight and darkness. Uh, enhance my feature a little all right so let's get started so i'm using um la girl pro concealers did you guys see that And do the same thing on this side. How do I look? After that, I'm gonna take another shade. I use pure beige for my highlighting. I'm gonna cover up some dark circles here so it does on this side. This line up here a little heavier. I'm gonna highlight this part so it's right here. So that's how I look like pretty much. <laughs> so after that, we're gonna take synthetic brush and we're gonna blend those in. And we're actually going to take this brush and blend over the nose. Let's 
so you, you're gonna create a shadow like that. I'm gonna create a shadow on the both sides. After your eye primer, and for the eye primer, Elf Eye Primer. I've been using this one for a long time, and I'm like super loving it. And I like it. it has the application on it, so I don't have to dig uh, my finger in it or anything. Morphe's Brushes Palette, actually. Of having blue on my eyes so we're gonna take the sparkly blue if you can see it there you go get a better view if I do this we're gonna apply this into the right of the middle of the eyelid so let's do that first You don't have to worry about it, it's just gonna be going to the middle part of the eyelid, so we're gonna blend this in, alright? Oh, the Professional Beauty Palette, it has all those colors on and it's super pigmented, it's super shimmery, so blue shade I'm gonna choose right up here. So we're gonna take that, we're gonna take this brush right in here. So what I do usually, I just go in the corners, the space I left, uh, and I go with the same eyeshadow inside right up here, close to the tear duct so I can blend those shadows in. So we're gonna create a branch right up here, so everything is matched and perfect, okay? We're gonna do the same thing on the other eye. The outer corner. And we're gonna try to create a branch right on top. And we're gonna pick the same eyeshadow and we're gonna do it right in here. Just left some space for the highlighting, um, like for the inner eyes. Okay, so you can barely see my eyeshadow now. And I'm gonna go back in and I'm gonna blend. I'm gonna put some more on so you guys can see the difference between two eyeshadows. Actually, I'm gonna pick it on my finger now. Because I was like, ugh. Oh. it's gonna look like okay so chill down we still got a couple steps to go after applying the dark blue eyeshadow we're gonna make an illusion of his lighter blue eyeshadow on top okay palette so we're gonna mix this blue top blue right in here and where is it and this blue right up here and it's gonna make really nice illusion of like seeing kind of like light blue color okay so we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna apply on top right up here making everything nice and
go, we're gonna go toward our highlight. Okay. And the face for the same purpose. And I'm just going with this beige nude highlight color. So after we are done with that part, we're gonna go ahead and grab our eyeliners. Where are my eyeliner jar? Oh, right up here. So actually, I love, I'm like in love with Milani's. Um, look how pretty this blue is. I'm in love with this blue so much. So we're going to take this one and I'm going to apply it right on to my waterline and under eye. So let's do that. make our eyes appear bigger I'm gonna take a uh, next white pencil and I'm gonna apply it on the waterline this gives the bigger eyes illusion blush palette in here look how pretty those colors are so I want it down with having lighter cheeks and lighter lip so, best pink in here. You can use any. So we're gonna apply the cheek color right above the very contour. You can see the contour line, the darker shade and the lighter shade up here. Milani's Eye Tech Extreme Liquid Eyeliner. So this time we're going to curl our lashes, okay? I actually normally do not apply any fake lashes on, so if you guys do that, go ahead do that, but my lashes are super long, but they're like straight stick so I have to curl them and put a mascara on them otherwise if I apply eyelashes on they looks my, my they makes my eye eyes look smaller I don't know it's probably applied it wrong or what but it's appeared my eyes smaller so because I have super thick and super straight eyelashes so we're gonna apply our mascara on <laughs> 